Dubai, a top investment destination, Sheikh Hamdan. Results reflect the confidence of investor community in Dubai's strategic plans, he says. Dubai, the Dubai FDR results in 2019 have continued to achieve distinct growth rates, making Dubai among the top three investment destinations in the world, said Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Crown Prince of Dubai and Chairman of the Executive Council. This was made possible thanks to the vision of His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Vice President and Prime Minister of the UAE and Ruler of Dubai. The results reflect the confidence of local and international investor community in Dubai's strategic plans and vision for the future, added Sheikh Hamdan. Sheikh Hamdan made these remarks ahead of the Dubai Investment Week, DIW 2019, which he instructed to be held from September 29 to October 3rd under the theme, Investing in the City of the Future. DIW 2019 will discuss potential opportunities for growth, partnership and innovation to make Dubai a model for the cities of the future. Sheikh Hamdan also called for strengthening cooperation between government entities and the investor community to enhance the productivity, competitiveness and returns of investment projects in the Emirates and contribute to sustainable economic development in the UAE and Dubai. Kate Middleton's bizarre flying habit revealed Duchess doesn't have to worry. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry might be the ones who have gotten a lot of criticism for their use of private flights during a series of travels over the summer, but traveling with a member of the royal family in a commercial flight may not always be a ideal option either if a new documentary is to be believed. The film Secrets of the Royal Flight reveals that at least during one flight Kate Middleton was able to use her status to score some extra seats on a plane but they weren't for members of her family or people at all. Obviously when go to the airports especially when it is hand luggage only we are trying to cram all our toiletries into that plastic bag Royal correspondent Emily Andrews said in that documentary it's never big enough no the roles don't have to worry about anything like that i've been on a plane where all kate's dress had their own seat to make sure they were kept flat they were not going to be shoved in the hole just to be squashed by everyone else the comment came after the royal family's flying habits particularly the duke and duchess of sussex came under fire and after middleton herself took a commercial flight with her husband prince william and children prince george princess charlotte and prince louise to scotland in august however it appears that while she may have utilized the bizarre move of giving her dresses their own seats in the past that particular flight didn't seem to include that tactic as passengers on the flight previously revealed that no one even realized the royal family was on board the flight of course if middleton was buying seats on a plane for her dresses that went with her for a particular trip or royal tour it could make sense the duchess has an expensive wardrobe overall and her average outfit could cost more than three thousand pounds than marcos with an average cost per look of twenty seven thousand one hundred and seventy two pounds the study determining the cost of her clothing, which was conducted by Hashash.com, included the £11,200 Alexander McQueen dress she wore for her sister Pippa Middleton's wedding. And if a large portion of the dresses the Duchess wears during events come with high price tags, she would likely want to make sure she took care of them in the best way possible while traveling.